Hello, Sri, I'm here with a new video and today I am here with a collab again. I love doing collab and today I am doing a face-off again and with a fellow Swede again. And this is a collab with Makeup by Blowfish. Her, that's not her name, her name is Emily. And she's from Sweden just like me and she's doing videos in English just like me. So, this face-off concept is created by Danielle. I will leave her channel down in the description and I will also leave Emily's. I hate to say to mix in Swedish names when I'm talking English because it's like, it's messed up my head. And <laughs> I will leave Makeup by Blowfish channel and video down in the description and also a channel up here. So we are doing a face-off with the Zulu palette by Juvia's. And this is a 9 pan palette and we decided to only take 4 colors because it's only 9 color in this palette. So we got the brown one, of course, the green shimmery one, the matte pink and the shimmery pink. And I think I know what I want to do. I think I have decided. So yeah, I zoom in a little bit, get started with makeup, tell you a little bit more about Emily, makeup by Blowfish, and then we just get started with this, <laughs> with this makeup. So I have primed my eyes and I will start with the matte, <laughs> the matte pink one. These colors doesn't have any names and I don't know why, but they don't have any names, so. Yes. And Emily, I have followed her for a pretty long time. She does some similar videos that I do. And she has a weekly makeup basket. I don't know if you still do these videos every week, I don't think, but you used to do it before and we have, it feels like we have pretty similar taste in like base makeup as well and yeah, you should really check her out. She is, okay, just have to be a little concerned with, with what I'm doing. I think you Emily just have like going into this really, really colorful, you always have, you have been colorful for a while, but exploring more colors, that's just the feel I get. And she, when I started Follow You, you, it, you talked a lot about nail polish. I don't think she do that anymore. Not like nail polish videos she did before. And if you didn't know this about me, I have been like a nail polish hoarder, I still am. I don't paint my nails as often anymore, but I love nail polishes. So I think that's how I found her from the beginning, but I have been subscribing for her for a really long time. So you should really check her out. And she's, one thing she and her husband, they are going to the US every year and then she have this amazing long haul videos. <laughs> I'm so jealous every time, and because I also want to do that. So something like that. And now I, for this look, I am not going to do that. That I'm not going to do what I think all of you are thinking. What I am doing. What? The? <laughs> I am taking the brown. Yes, I am, and I'm going to put this in my crease as well. So I just tap off the brush, take a smaller blending brush and put it in my crease. And I I really don't understand why they put a brown on this. And when we decided, me and Emily, that we were going to take this palette, and then I go to random.org to know which colors and this brown one, I was like, yeah, of course, of course, the brown one. I think it was the first shade that came up and I was like, why? 
so yeah, I usually don't use this brown one because I don't reach for this palette for the brown. So yeah, here I am taking this brown shade. It is a nice brown shade, it's nothing wrong with it, but it's just I don't think it belongs in this palette. So, and I will actually take the brown one on my lid as well. And why, you may ask? Just because I don't want to do what is like the most obvious thing for me to do. It feels like this is not the most obvious thing for me. As you see, it's, it's nothing wrong at all with this brown shade. Okay, so now I am taking the green one and I think I maybe want to do a half cut crease. And now when I look at this, yes, I want to. But I don't want to cut my crease with like a concealer, so I take the glitter glue from NYX. And then I maybe need a brush. Okay, so I will just lay down this clear glue. In my inner corner. Just pop it on here. So then I will go in with the green one. And I don't want this to too sticky so I take the green one and this is just look at this this green one is amazing this whole palette is super amazing but this green one it is something special about it and I think I will go overboard with this Okay, and then I take the brush that I used to the brown shade and just try to smudge the edge out a little, blend them together and then I go in with the green brush again and go over it. I go in with the pink in my inner crease again, the matte pink, just here to smudge the edge up there a little. Just to have the pink. And why did I take this big brush for this? So I think, I think I like this. So we do the same thing on the other eye. So something like this and I think, I think I like this. Or I am okay with this. I love the green, I don't know about the brown. I think I wish the brown was a little bit darker just to like have it a little bit more smoky but I don't think I can get the brown any darker go in and some more maybe if I should have put a pink underneath and then brown over I think I will go with this. So I will take away the fallouts, fix my base and my brows and then we have this shimmery pink left and then I have used all the four shades for this face off. So I will fix my face and then I will come back and fix the rest of the makeup. So I am back and for my under eyes I will take um, the two shimmer shades we got. So the pink and the green one. And I will have the green one in here and the pink out here, I think. So I will actually spray this pink. I think it would go without spraying, but I don't want any, I don't want any fallouts. Because I have already done my base, as you can see. And I actually... F I soon am going to cut my hair, finally. And I think I'm going to cut it like this, this length. Um, I have a pretty long hair right now and I think I'm going to cut it like this because then I can blend it into my outgrown side cut. A just little side story. So, okay, um, I'm going to do this now.
and then I will take the green one put it in my inner corner and also like to here to connect it with the pink one so I think the under eyes are set like this maybe a little bit more of the green one just in here so I think I am finished I'm going to put I think a pink in my wash line or maybe something else put on a lipstick mascara and then I will be back with the finished look so this is the finished look for my wash line I used boots from Colourpop and for my lips I used Gemini from Jeffree Star and I I like this look first I was a little bit bummed out by the brown but now when I have the finished result I I like it so for this face off we used the brown one, the shimmer green, the matte pink and the shimmer pink. And thank you so much Emily for wanting to do a collab with me. It will be so fun to see what you've done with these four colors. And this was her first face off so it will be so fun to see how it went for her so don't forget to check out emily say hello from me if you're heading over there which i think you should and yeah i really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel please do so you don't miss any of my videos and i will see you in the next one bye